it's wedged in. Oh, you're getting very close. Huh? You're getting very close to its head. Good to see you again. There's a few widow makers around and it's a bit windy, but as always, I trust in God for my protection. And I just want to tell you what uh, happened this morning. I was out just messing around with the camera. It's a little bit of a hobby. And I was just out the back and there's some bird boxes. There was a sparrow stuck in the entrance to one of the bird boxes. So its beak was in the bottom. It was trying to enlarge the hole and its head was stuck in the top and it, it couldn't get out. So it was stuck there. And I had to intervene else it would have died and it, it would have just been stuck in there. But there's a family of blue tits actually live in that box. So they wouldn't have been able to get access. My wife was at home. So she was able to assist me and together we carried out the rescue operation and it was a success so thank god for that and as i was doing that and just afterwards I was, I was thinking you know god cares about the sparrows he cares about all of his creation he cares about you and he doesn't want you to worry be careful Careful, you're getting very close. Huh? You're getting very close to its head. Whatever's going on in the world at the moment, or at any moment, you don't, you shouldn't have to worry. Just trust in God, but look for God's righteousness. Matthew 6 tells us, don't worry about what, you, what you'll wear, about what you're going to eat, about what you're going to drink. Just seek God's kingdom first of all. And all of these things, what you wear, what you eat, will be provided for you as well. Because God clothes the animals. He provides for them. He provides for all of his creation and he loves it and he watches over it. But he loves you much more than anything else in creation. You're created in God's own image. And you're his crown and glory. He made this world for you. He made us stewards of this world. We should be responsible and look after it. And that's what I was doing when I rescued that sparrow. I'm not into the full on climate agenda that humans are destroying the planet and we're bad for it. Because that's a, it's a bigger agenda. On the surface it seems good. And we should be stewards, I agree. We should look after the planet. We should look after creation. We should be responsible. But the Bible tells us, Matthew 10, I think it's verse 25, Jesus says, are two sparrows not sold for a copper coin? But yet your father knows everything about them and not one of them falls to the ground without your father's knowledge. So he does care about things that we might think are insignificant. He cares about all of them, but he cares much more about you. And I want you to, to know that today. And I want you to, to take comfort from that. Contact me if you've got any questions or you want to see anything. Let me know where you're from, say hi. I'll always answer you, but be encouraged. God loves you. You're worth more than many sparrows, much more. I love you. God loves you. God's in me and he's in you if you're born again. So praise God. God bless you. Thanks for watching. You're all right, little bird. Settle down. <gasps> calm down, calm down. You're gonna be free soon. Oh, peace in Jesus' name. You're gonna need to hold its body, I think. <gasps> Careful, little bird. You're all right. Ooh.